Welcome to Pensacola Beach. I have not done a video in a little while and there are a few updates I want to share with you. I know you're probably excited you're making plans to come and visit Pensacola Beach. It is beautiful and waiting for you. So let's check it out. All right, first thing, they painted our water tower, the Pensacola Beach Ball, which looks amazing. And they also did a paint job on our band shell. This is the old color that we used to have. And here's our new color. How bougie. Anyway, it looks great. I really like it. And there's a couple other things that we have that are changing on the beach side. And one of them is the Hampton Inn, which is right by the beach. They're putting in a new tower and it's gonna go right where this green building is, a small building, that's where they have the UFO mini golf and there's like an arcade and snack bar in there, but they're gonna put a brand new tower there there's also gonna be a parking garage, and on top of the tower, there's gonna to be a helipad, and they're gonna do renovations to the Hampton Inn. It's gonna be amazing. All right, another thing is we are getting a new hotel, Fairfield Inn and & Suites, and it's supposed to be opening in the spring of 2023, which is amazing. It's gonna have a great back area with the pool, and I am just really excited that we're getting another hotel right on our beach. And next up is Badass Coffee. And this is kind of in the area where the shrimp basket is. And according to their website, it looks like we might be getting this in 2023. It said it should have been open maybe winter, but now maybe it'll be early this year. Next up is the Pensacola Bay Cruises. And the main port is downtown, but there was some damage to the dock at the boardwalk. And so that was closed for a very long time, but now they've fixed it. So it's gonna be really nice to have that back and open at the boardwalk so people can enjoy this throughout the spring and the summer. And speaking of the boardwalk, there is some more construction. Captain Fun, we don't know what's going in there, but that used to be a fun little spot. So now we just have some old building that we're looking at for now. But we also do have some construction going on. They're fixing some roof and the patio area for bamboo willies and hooters. So they're both kind of undergoing a little facelift, which is kind of nice. That'll be good and ready once everybody's ready to head over to the beach. All right, and I know I've mentioned Whiskey Joe's in my past videos, but it is up and running, it's ready to go. I actually was able to experience it and it was a lot of fun. I think it's gonna be even more fun when it's spring and summer. They have a great outdoor area and I'm just looking forward to hanging out there a little bit more. So I just figured I'd give you a little bit more of a video on what it looks like and the feel of this place. It's kind of a fun little vibe. All right, and I love Shaggy's, and I noticed something very unique about this place. I don't know why I didn't notice it before, but behind Shaggy's, there's like this little marina, so you can rent a dolphin tour. You can also take a fishing boat ride to catch some fish. And Shaggy's actually has a sign that says, if you catch it, then they'll cook it for you. So just bring it to them. And I thought that was kind of a unique little thing. So there you go. Lastly, the park over by the Fort Pickens entrance, it was uh, under construction. There was some damage from different storms and it was closed for a very long time. So they repaired that. They actually did some painting and they fixed stairs and walkovers to the beach and it looks really great now. So I just thought I would share that. Also, this is one of my favorite places because it has such a beautiful view. There's hardly anybody over here usually. So it's a great little spot to hang out.
And that will do it for my updates this time. You guys, thank you so much for watching and I will see you soon.